with these wood grips by Metolius. Again, we're really liking them in our training just to mix up a bit. So now we're going to use these as a hor horizontal rowing movement or inverted row movement. So kind of spice these up a bit, make them a little more challenging if they find they're too easy for you. So again, we're going to have a lot of emphasis on our hands, our wrists, forearms, and stability as well because these are independently moving. So again, we'll do that first one. We got these just underneath our stairs here. We'll have our feet on our steps for a horizontal row, get the body parallel. Just do regular rows, making sure we pull these apart for back emphasis. Again, these are a lot more challenging than the traditional inverted rows. So back's nice and straight, chest is up, pull them apart each time. Okay, again, second one, we're going to go over that crushing type of a movement. Going to get a more perspective from this angle here. So in this one, keeping the grips together, pulling up and pulling down. So a lot of crushing going on with the chest, which is pretty rare for a pulling movement. So a lot of muscles being worked in this compound exercise. So same idea, get that body parallel, pick your grip. So as you see here, this time I'm keeping them together, keeping them nice and tight. Chest is together. Very demanding. Especially on the biceps. So for an arm wrestler that needs strength in three dimensions to be able to pull back, but also have side pressure, lots of form and bicep strength, that one can be very effective as well to add into your training. All right, guys, we're going to give that a shot. We'll see you next time.